what is the security thing that people should at least make sure they have a like as a basic base covered? This is an involved question. You're looking for a single answer, so I'm going to answer it in a different way if you don't mind. Perfect, yeah. So there are certain things that you have to do yourself as a business. And number one is understanding what the business actually is, who the customers are and what the relationships look like and what do you actually care about. Because whoever is going to attack is going to attack something that you care about, that has something of value, right? Because that's why businesses exist. So every business needs to understand what they have that people would like to steal or destroy or whatever. We are, in fact, all connected today. If you look at attacks and how attacks have been successful, 90 some plus percent of the successful breaches were because somebody used the bad password. It's so silly. You know, we're in 2022 now, we're 25 plus years in this journey, and people still use passwords that I can guess sitting here in about two minutes. So that is actually the number one attack vector. It's kind of simple. So, you know, Salesforce went out a couple of years back and said, hey, all Salesforce customers use multi-factor auth. And, you know, there is multi-factor auth in, in a lot of different places. Some of them are probably harder than others to, to, you know, open up and stuff. But at least not use a single password to log into the Salesforce ecosystem because that is the number one attack vector, like by a lot. So, yeah, if if I were to advise somebody, force all your users to update your your authentication. Don't allow a password to be the the only authenticator. 